What's up everybody? Welcome back to Graceland Farm. Today we're gonna to talk a little bit about sheep. I'm gonna actually move the sheep netting today. It's on the back side of this barn behind me. And uh, we like to move them around a little bit. We kind of use them like a lawnmower. And we try to keep them off certain areas for a little while so it gives them time to recover and have great grass for them to eat. Anyways, if you like sheep, just stick around. If you haven't already, subscribe, like this video. Go ahead and subscribe and like it. Got to unhook this. So hook to our main wire around the whole patch. I've got an area on the back side of the barn that I have not fenced in yet. So right now what I've got is I've got electric netting and this netting can be used for lots of different animals. You can use it for sheep, goats. You keep chickens in with it, maybe some turkeys. Um, they have a smaller fence. It's about half the height of this one that you can use for pigs. Right now I just got two strands running around for my pigs. But anyways, I've got to get this unhooked. So the fence is not hot. When you got what you got. I just wanted everybody to, to see that you don't have to have a whole, whole lot of property to have sheep. And if you've got the proper netting and, and the time to move it, it is well worth it. If they wanted to come over here with me and see what I'm doing. I've moved them with them inside the fence, but today I've got to move a lot of the fence. I don't want any of my sheep to get out, so I'm gonna go ahead and run them back over to the other side. Hopefully, pretty quick and easy. We'll see how that goes. Over there. All right, so all I've got left is I've got to hook it back up. I may have to go around and tighten the fence in a couple places. Hook the fence back up. And this is what I've got right now. I'm gonna go get me some gator clips that I can run through this fence and hook right into the hot wire. But this is what I got for right now and it works great. I'm gonna hook it back up. Love them some fresh grass. Come on. Come on girls. Ain't quick enough for them. Looky there. Got them some fresh grass. They'll have this eat down in just a few hours. It's probably. a lot faster if you just go ahead and move them out of the way. You just pull the stakes out of the ground and lay them all the same way. You don't want to lay one backwards and one forwards. These sheep are pretty fun to raise. There's really not a whole lot to it. It's pretty simple. This netting's not very expensive. You can get it from Premier One, 160 foot or something like that. I think I paid around $150 for it. Right here just to show the difference and where they've been and where they haven't been. It's very, very easy to see. You can kind of see on here. And whenever this, all this grass grows back out, it'll be a whole lot greener than it is on the outside right now. And that's a wrap for today, guys. Thank you, and as always, God bless.